Hi guys, my name is Ada and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I've been long gone per usual, but I'm back. And I wanted to start out by doing a very minimal, I mean, no bullshit skincare routine. And also, I forgot to let you guys know, if you guys haven't done so, please subscribe to me channel because that would be amazing basically i just wanted to show you guys my skincare routine i feel like it's very important um, please excuse this really annoying red situation going on right here i don't know what is happening it's just an annoying red beating like color that's on the side of my face i'm like over it by now my very first thing that i do is i like to double cleanse so i like to use the glam glow this one right here it is a gentle bubble daily conditioning cleanser so let's start off with that and it looks like this that is done i rinsed out my face and i like to dab to dry off the water Sometimes um, you would get like some uh, mascara still on your eyes and a little eyeliner if you have it. So I use a cotton pad, these little ones right here, it comes in this box. Now this is the one I got from Daiso and they're huge. There's 90 of these babies in here and two of these are a little over $2. So they're like a dollar a piece, which is great. And I don't believe in spending a lot of money for cotton pads. I mean, you're just gonna throw them away. And I use two kinds of Marcella water. This is Yes Two Cotton. And this one um, was three, three bucks. And this is Marcella water, I use this. And I love this because it has like a pumping thing. Now, if I have lashes, I do this one right here. The only reason why I use this one is because there's no oil in it and if you have um, those lash extensions you need one without any oils but since I don't have any I'm just gonna use this baby right here I tend to just focus on the eyes because I know with that I tend to always like have some residue still left over okay my face is basically like cleaned out there's just like a little bit of dark spots from my mascara still being left on and other than that this is all good to go i love this you get to see all the gunk that you still haven't been able to get out from your um your cleanser my secret weapon and i live by this so much i do not know what i have been doing before this whole beauty thing just started like let me just show you guys so i started using i know believe it or not i started using toners I did not know what a toner was until I started like watching a whole bunch of skincare routines from other YouTubers and they, sh they are very strict with their toners and they love them so much so I decided to try it. And this one is a Pixie Glow Tonic Toner and I heard a lot of great things about this so I decided to try it. My very first toner fell in love. Works like a charm. I literally only have this much left. I need to get some more but i love this this is what i use after i'm done with my cleanser my face is dry some people like to put on a cotton pad i don't i think that's a waste so i just put some a little bit on my hands rub it in and just dab it on my face but ever since i started using the toner my bum started disappearing and my face i feel like it's just doesn't have a lot of blemishes anymore Besides today, because I have this disgusting red thing on my face. So yeah, Glow Tonic um, Pixie brand. I think this was like about six, seven dollars. Last step. I know this is like the fastest skincare routine in the world. My last step is my moisturizer. These two types of moisturizer. Basically, if I'm going out and putting makeup on my face, I use this one. This is the Trader Joe's Ultra Hydrating Gel Moisturizer and this was like five bucks. It is 
infused with aloe and green tea extract. It doesn't really have much of a scent, which I love, but it just feels clean and it doesn't feel too heavy when I know I'm about to put loads and loads of makeup on my face. I love this so much. Oh, I also do the neck region because I am not wanting to look old over here, okay? If I am not putting um, any makeup on, let's say like before I go to bed, I do this one, which is the Shea, hold on, let me show you. This one right here, Shea Moisturizer. This is with Peach Rose Oil Complex as Sensitive Skin Facial Moisturizer. This one has a very strong scent, like it's like it has a very strong rose scent, which I love when I go to bed. Um, but yeah, and this is m much more thicker than the ones that I just put on. But I like this one because, like I said, when before I go to bed, I'm not gonna have anything on my face. It just feels very nice and cozy. But I think that was it, guys. That's like the shortest skincare routine. I kid you not, I live by this. Who has 10 steps to get their face prepped before they go out? I keep it to one, two, three steps, maybe four when I want to feel, you know, a little extra. But three steps is all you need. Freaking cleanser, toner, moisturizer, good to go. Start with these basics and then if you want to splurge a little bit, spend a little bit more. Okay? Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys next time. Okay?